Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Cross Country Pipeline Division. Today we will be seeing the procedure for CIT that is coating integrity test in the pipeline. The scope of this procedure includes the coating integrity test after pullback of the HDD pipeline section of the road, rails, canals and the river crossings. Let us see the methodology, the procedure of CIT. The integrity of the pipeline coating shall be carried out after the pullback through the HDD pipeline section. The test must be carried out before the HDD pipeline section is tied to the main line section. Pipe to cable connection to be done both sides of the HDD section. Measure the PSP of the HDD section at both ends. Set up the temporary immerse current with a digital multimeter connected to measure the output of the current, the GI copper strip at a minimum 5 meter distance from the HDD pipeline section. The DC source 12 volt battery shall be used to provide the immerse current into the HDD section. The positive terminal or the DC source connects to the ground through the GI or the copper strip and the negative terminal to the pipeline through the potentiometer. Place the reference cell at the remote in opposite to the immerse current system to monitor the PSP of the HDD section. Immerse current of the HDD pipeline starts at 0 amps and increases slowly until the HDD pipeline potential dippers to 1.5 volt with respect to the reference electrode. Know the current from the digital multimeter and calculate the current slowly. The desirable value of the current density shall be less than 95 micro amperes per square meter of the drilled pipe shall surface in contact with soil. Current density the formula is IT in 2000 divided by surface area where IT is the current applied into the HDD pipeline section to maintain a voltage of 1.5 volt at the other end of the pipeline section. This is a diagram that you can see in the pipeline. Pipeline is, from the pipeline it has been connected to the clamp meter. Clamp meter it is, it is connected to the PSP uh, multimeter. The multimeter to a potentiometer that is the variable resistor and the variable resistor it has been connected to the negative terminal of the battery. And the positive terminal is grounded with a GI strip of an or a magnesium anode or zinc anode and the reference cell is being provided at the multimeter end. So the, the desirable value of the current density shall be less than 95 micro ampere per meter square for a successful coating integrity test. I hope this video is been is clear there is a video of the practical video is already applied uploaded into our site you can check that thank you